Hey what's up guys, it's me Mike, and today I'm going to show you guys how to create this cool wallpaper that I call Rain. Basically, I'm going to show you guys how to make it rain in Photoshop. It sounds pretty cool, sounds fun, now let's get into it. Alright, so basically what you want to do is create a new background, um, any size wallpaper size that you like to use on your desktop. For me, as always, it's 1440 by 900 and um, I like to invert it so it could be black. I always start off with my text and rain awesome okay now I'm gonna make sure it's centered a little bit nah, that looks fine um okay so this is important in my last video I showed you guys how to colorize and everything same procedure but um, a little bit different we're gonna select our brush right we're gonna create first create a new layer right I'm going to make sure whatever our rain color you want it to be, make sure that's in the foreground. And any other optional color you can have in the background. So I got different two different shades of gray. So I'm going to select a soft edge brush, um, size 70 pixel and zero hardness. Okay, and then I'm going to select that brush panel at the top right here to bring up my brush preset panel. Go to brush tip shape, and this is important right here. You want to make sure your spacing is at least 165 or something like that. It may differ depending on what type of brush and everything like that. For the angle, you want to make sure you put it at 45 degrees. And for the roundness, I chose to use 10. Alright, now for the shape dynamics, you want to make sure the size jitter is all the way up to 1000. And for the scattering, you want to make sure that's also up to 1000. Um, this is optional. You could do transfer. Basically, it um, uh, messes around with the opacity of certain pixels or certain um, brushes that's that's gonna fall out. So mine is set to 45. If you'd like to use that. Now, again, we're gonna use the color dynamics, and we're gonna make sure our foreground is all the way up to 100. Um, for this one, I'm using those two shades of blue. So there we go. Now, before I add my rain, I'm gonna go ahead and give my uh, rain over here a a um, excuse me a layer effect so I'm just gonna copy this one over here because I really like it and I'm gonna show you guys actually how to make that cool layer style right here where you guys can actually download it alright so here we go just gonna right click and paste that layer style in there there we go now I'm gonna select my new layer select my brushes and basically I'm just gonna start from one angle just come down start again come down so you see the pattern here huh so this is pretty much how you make it rain in Photoshop hope you guys enjoyed this video it's me Mike and I'll catch you guys later remember guys be creative peace